was a different life. I need a new cohesive Only unit now. I... This guy, he's kind of useless. He just sits here going on about the power of the atom bomb, the maniac. So he's going to be much more useful to me as a new member of the cohesive unit. Let's give him a gun. And some ammunition, but not all of it, but just some of it. You're gonna join me on my path, Cromwell. I've recruited uh, Jericho finally. It cost me all my Come fucking money seconds. too. I want to talk to you. But he's a—I think he's an invincible follower, so he should be worth the money. Because I've always preferred wandering the wasteland in a cohesive unit, you may have noticed. Just a bit more interesting than being on your own. I mean, when I first played this game, it actually made me kind of depressed. Because the atmosphere, this barren wasteland. It's got and this haunting, sort of lonely music that it had. Yeah, Deputy Wold died. I didn't uh, record it, but uh, I think a raider turned up. Took him out. Can't be helped. Tried to save him, but failed. Yeah, I'm just gonna wander up here and uncover some of the map, get into some exciting adventures. Come on, cohesive unit, eliminate this creature. Good work. Cromwell's using his green phaser. I've recruited Nathan as well. Because he thinks he's so... He's an Enclave supporter. So he thinks he's a badass, so... Join me then, Enclave supporter. You might get to meet your heroes out here somewhere, because... They're around. One thing that's kind of pissed. I've got this mod on for the the different kind of weather effects and stuff, and lately every kind of weather is this this one, this yellow sky shit. I want to see that car, that cool kind of blue sky atmosphere. What the hell? It never seems to change, like it's crashed or something. When I first put it on, it was really gorgeous blue skies. That's why I picked the mod. I don't want this yellow hideous sky. It looks crap. Doesn't seem to change, man. Anybody know why? Write in the comments below. Save me from the monotonous sky. It must be above me. Red markers. We're on the bridge. Let's find a way up to that bridge. We can't have that. We can't have enemies escaping me. My goal is to wipe out all living human life in the wasteland. Coming at you, Raider! Right to the head, you punk! Mysterious stranger, get him! You miss it! Yeah, he's out. Yep. This Raider's hanging out on this bridge. Found the way up. Come on, cohesive unit. This way. Shit. Got some powerful weaponry on my team here. Enjoy! The hell with this. What the fuck? Heads up! <laughs> Death. You know, I don't recall this bridge from the first time I played this game. I don't remember this. It's 
That's what's great about Fallout. You can play it quite a lot of times and you'll still miss stuff. Oh shit, look at my health. I never even notice half the time my health on this game. Don't even pay attention. Fuck you. Get out the fucking dirty Harry Magnum bunker. Sucker, and there's more. Right to the heart. Ooh, ooh, my heart. Come on, cohesive team. That's right. Finally, started to get rid of this cold I was having. Fucking pissing me off. You better run. Look at the Atom guy, Cromwell, he's doing good. Look at him, they can't wait to- oh, Nathan's almost dead, I'm gonna have to give him a stim pack. He won't talk to me until he's not in combat anymore. People have been asking if I'm doing the DLC. Well, of course I am. I've uh, bought all of it. I got it off Steam with everything, so. Never actually played the, uh, the UFO one. Mothership Zeta. Never played that. All the other, all the other DLC I played before and loved it. I gotta be honest, my favorite DLC was The Pit. Because it was the... I liked the whole you could be a scumbag or you could save the slaves. And it had a really good atmosphere. It felt very Mad Max. It was cool. Point Lookout was cool as in it was really big. But it didn't feel very Fallout-y because it just felt like more of a resi game. You were in a swamp and stuff. It felt a bit horror-y, not uh, apocalyptic. Have you seen my wife anywhere? Well, your wife's back in Megatron, buddy. Well, I've seen a stim pack, and you need one. Back to full health. I want to play Half-Life 2 as well. I've actually... I've got Half-Life 2 on PC. And I've seen that there's a mod that improves the graphics quite immeasurably improves them. I haven't actually got that mod working though. But if I do, I'll do a playthrough of Half-Life 2 because that's probably my favorite ever first person action game ever. It's Half-Life 2. I love the atmosphere of that game. It's one of the few games I've ever played where I actually cared about the story. Like, currently I'm playing Far Cry 3 and I despise the story in that game. But some people, for some reason, think because I hate the story, I therefore hate the game. I love the game, but I just don't like the story. If, if I, to me, story doesn't matter much in video games, to be honest. It matters to me in movies. Big time. But in games, I think the gameplay is more important, really. Like, the, even the, for, the Fallout 3 story, the actual main story of your dad and the whole water purifying thing. I don't care about that story that much in it. I love the lore and the design of the world and all the factions and all the little stories going on, but the mass, the basic story that you're following, the main quest, that I don't really think it's that good. I thought it was better in New Vegas. Wild Boar. Deputy Weld? 
How can that be? I saw him die. What? Is this a replacement deputy well that wandered out into the wasteland? What the hell? Deputy Weld. Welcome back. An abominable mutation. Get back, deputy. How come he's... What the fuck? Deputy Well is shooting at me! They have to take him out clean. Why would Deputy Well be here again when he died in front of Megaton? Yeah, if you're wondering what those wild iguanas are, they're part of the monster mod. I'm assuming maybe Deputy Well wandering around here, that was part of the monster mod too, I don't know. Crazy. What's this? A raider party. A naked raider. And a bunch of other raiders. What's going on here? A gangbang? Missile launch, these fucking fuckers. I love the missile launcher. What the fuck? They're like taking turns to beat up on one of their own. What the fuck? Your turn. Your turn to take a turn with Dickwad. See you later! Put you out of your misery, sucker! Ha <laughs> ha! Took them all out. <laughs> you fucking morons. Why are you letting them sit there beating on you, you big dickhead? Well, cohesive unit, we may as well go in this vault while we're here. I can't remember which vault this is. One oh six doesn't mean anything to me. Make way there. The door's not even open. Yeah, see the scavenger hasn't followed me. They don't they don't come in buildings. So we're down a cohesive member. What horrors await me? Really, cigarettes are getting harder to find. Really cool the way uh, there was all these different weird, horrible things that had happened to the other vaults. <laughs> this would make a great fucking movie, though. Fallout. I'd love to do a movie on this. So for those of you who are new to the channel who don't know, I've actually made a feature film. It's out to buy on DVD in England. Uh, it's called Eye Against Eye. Um, it was only a cheap low. Ooh. It's good to be out here again. I just saw a scientist. He walked into a closed door. Hello? This place haunted or something? Hey. Where? I what the? Be still. It's an insane survivor. Uh, oh my god, he's killed someone! I don't know which member of my team that was. I couldn't tell. You're gonna get trained up. You wanna play melee, do you? We can play melee. Chainsaw! We're gonna get insane. We'll get insane with a chainsaw, sucker. He killed Cromwell. God, he was doing alright with that fucking phaser. Jesus Christ. Where's the other member of the cohesive team? Well, it's another another guy down. It's like a bad horror movie where members of the team keep getting picked off one by one. 
Yeah, I think this is that place where you go insane when you're inside it because of the gas and the uh Yeah, look, I'm seeing things. I'm seeing my dad. They should have done something cool where you follow a stat to go insane in here. In fact, I think they might do. I'm sure like they start saying stuff. Imagine if you, you, your buddies turned on you because they went insane. You have to kill your buddies. I I was insane oh, guys yeah. behind you, you prick. Ah. I'm going to change all your head off from that haircut, you fuck up. Ah. You're blocking me. Ah. Forget this. Oh, the shock sword. That is a melee weapon. You think you're pretty tough, don't you? Electrical attack! Electrical sword! Anyone who's been on the around on the channel long enough will remember a video uh, I did once called uh, Girls First Time. Um, it was a chick basically playing Modern Warfare 3 fucking badly because she was fucking useless at it. Um, I'm thinking about bringing Laura, that's her name, into these commentaries just for some amusement because she's quite funny. She'd probably be more funny where she's not being the star of the video, if you will. Um, I haven't asked her yet, but um, I'm going to try and see if she's up for it because I think it'll be funny to bring more people into this cohesive conversation. I've got the one of my best friends, he won't do it. He just hates he wouldn't he'd hate doing it. Um I've got another good friend who's moved away, he's moved up to Scotland. He's up for doing it. But uh it's when he comes down here. We've been ambushed by an insane survivors with the worst haircuts ever. This is these guys truly have gone insane with those haircuts. Fuck you, you fucker don't kill him! I don't want any more fucking cohesive dickheads to get killed. There's another one of these fuck ups. Eat this, you scum. So, yeah, let me know if you think that. Uh, including more people in the cohesive commentary would be interesting what the fuck oh there's more how come these insane guys aren't attacking each other if they're all insane they're just waiting for me to come along fuck have I been that way that's what I mean, I get lost in these fucking places. Yeah, the gas sent everybody mad, didn't it? Where my cohesive unit? They've not even followed me in here! Where are they? Where are you? What were you two shooting at then? These guys followed me? Where did they come from? You came through a wall? You bug-ridden fucking game! Feel the electric burning and ebbing within you. Uh -huh. You enjoy it, dude. Good work, cohesive unit. Where the hell? Where the hell have they gone? There's another one of these fucking twats. What the fuck? Where are they coming from? You block me! You dare block me ever! place is filled with scum. This is a hive for scum and villainy. What the? I'm seeing things! 
Paul Hannon wasn't really there. Fucking, you're a survivor, are you? You think you can be invisible, do you? Well, survive that fucker! Phasered. Sword phaser. Nathan's almost dead. I'll give you another stim pack. You missed! Stop that blade! Robot! Raiden's become more powerful than He-Man! There's more! Yeah! 